Eight groups in the United States is on the rise, and some of them are right here in Northern California. So what is behind this increase, and where can those hate groups be found in our area? CBS 13's Macy Jenkins has been investigating this new study. She joins us live now in the newsroom with the answer. Macy? Well, guys, eight of those groups are right here in the Sacramento area. The numbers come from the Southern Poverty Law Center, and the spike in the number of anti-hate groups in the last year may surprise you. Our country is polarized right now. It's, you know, every it's we want to blame somebody for everything. And in 2015, thousands of Americans across the country were pointing fingers. Anti-government groups on the rise. Anti-Muslim groups up 42 percent in one year, and the number of Ku Klux Klan groups has more than doubled since 2014. They're bringing drugs. They're bringing crime. They're rapists, and some. I assume are good people. When Donald Trump is calling Mexicans rapists and, you know, that, that, that's, that's a concern. That's, I talked to Bassem El Cara, president of the Sacramento Valley Council on American Islamic Relations. Every election season, for the past few cycles, we've seen an uptick in, in hate incidents and um, in, in hate rhetoric. But Kevin Daniel with the Greater Sacramento Urban League says racial tension began to build long before this election. I'm not surprised. I, I've kind of seen it slowly rise firsthand. Um, ever since uh, Obama became president. In 2008, the number of hate groups sat at 926. By 2011, that shot up to 1,018. But in 2014, it went down to 784. Last year, it spiked back up to 892. And in the top five states for these groups, California is number two. So what's the solution? We watch it and and we try to find ways to work together to, to push back against hate. Elkara says divisive talk should die down when the election is over, but for Daniel, there's no more time to wait. We're all looking for the same things, and if we begin talking about what we have in common and begin to diminish the things we have apart, it makes things a little bit easier for us. The Southern Poverty Law Center put this list together using websites and publications from various hate groups. They also consulted police reports and news reports. The they found the total number in California to be 68.